It's a Valentine's Day edition of the show. Oh. And um, yeah, Charlie, what's up? Happy chocolate day. Yeah. Yeah. We got this from uh, CPC. Uh, uh. So we're taking it. <laughs> oh, Charlie, um, but what are your plans later tonight? It's Valentine's Day, you know? If you don't have a ticket to the love experience, well, it's your last opportunity to grab one to the Joy FM Love Experiences, your official Valentine um, event happening mm. at the La Bajibi mm. Hotel tonight. Mm. There's Kwabina Kwabina and Becca headlining that event. Live music, like good live music, good food, good drinks as well. Mm. Uh, and what's more, there is the beach staring at you. So please get a ticket and let's meet at the La Bajibi Hotel tonight. I'll see you there. I agree. Yeah, okay, let's do the news. Are you, are you I'm, eating I'm okay. on set? I didn't, I didn't be a do. Okay, let, let me start with the newspaper. <laughs> mm. All right, uh, let's do the front page of the Daily Graphic newspaper. Uh, front page says Ghana's aviation makes gains. Bad weather in sub region diverts flights to Kotoka uh, port. So Ghana has started raking in the benefits of its investments and the robust aviation navigation installations it has deployed over the years as part of measures to make the country the aviation hub in the West African sub-region. Subsequently, story says that the Kotoka International Airport, considered one of the safest airports on the continent, has begun receiving aircraft bound for other West African countries, but which cannot land there due to Hamatan haze. The aircraft diversions to Accra follows a... Um, a consensus reached by aviation sector experts in West Africa that the KIA had better air navigation and instrument landing systems needed to guide aeroplanes down even during intensified dusty dry. When, so that's certainly good news for us. I don't know, do the passengers get down into the country? Mm. Because then that would mean also because of, of the, the, the coronavirus, that will also mean that Rigorous checks will have a lot more. It depends. Um, it depends on the delay. People so. coming into mm. than mm. whatever. If it's but, just for fifty minutes, then mm. you'll be asked. But it means we are making money, so which well, is definitely. good. Uh, also on the front page, absorb cost of childhood cancer treatment. Foundation appeals to the NHIA. President reassigns to ministers. One of the biggest stories in our country yesterday. Uh, Brian Echampon moved to the Interior Ministry, mm. not necessarily as a deputy. He would still be Minister of State. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But at the Interior Ministry. And mm. lots of questions were asked yesterday. First of all, why that change? Was it because of the uh, Commission of Enquiry? Remember mm. that commission that looked into the Ayawaso West yeah. to work on violence because there were concerns of all overlaps in responsibilities and who reports to who, that kind of thing. Mm. Uh, there are also rumors that the relationship between him and Kandapa haven't been the best. So things flying around, but you know how it is. When the president assigns or reassigns, he doesn't owe you any explanation apart from to tell you that these are the changes that, that he's made. Mm -hmm. So, you know, people still talking around. I heard something again that said, um, Mr. Ambrose Derry's deputy, the one who's been now taken to national Mr. security, also didn't have a very good relationship with, with him. Okay. So, uh, but these are all rumors. Yeah, you know. when you call those, so everything is fine. <laughs> okay, so let's look at the, the other headlines, like though. Myself and you, we don't get along, but we don't. We, we pretend as if everything is fine. We don't. <laughs> That's strange. Uh, okay, students in oh, China, so it's not safe to evacuate them. According to the health service, Fantastic. yesterday, oh, Fantastic. ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Roland uh, Walker. Is it from my lady? This is Felsom. Felsom Ghana. This is from your wife. Ooh. <laughs> oh, nice, and nice. There's a, a gum here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm a dumb okay, person. Roland Walker. Nice. On behalf of Felicia, your beautiful wife, mm. these are yours. Awesome. On this day. Awesome. Thank you. Oh, look at your romantic face. Ah, this is romantic. Nice chocolate. Are you surprised? Uh, <laughs> I'm a, I'm a, I am a surprise. <laughs> oh, shit. Shall I open uh, this? Did I say that on air? <laughs> <laughs> I see. Did you say that? Yeah, I think I did. I apologized. 
Okay. Yes. So what do we put there? I think we put this. It's for you. So whatever you do yeah. with it, it's fine. Wow. Oh, we should open this. I'll open this sometime. Fell some. Fell yeah. some. Fell some. Fantastic. Fell Can some. we just focus on Roland for a minute? Fell some. Roland has never been surprised. <laughs> never. Oh, <well. laughs> never. Never done Is anything it? like. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Romantic. And just so you know. Hey, it ready Open it, let everybody see it. Oh, we apologize. We had to interrupt the... Uh, Mikaela, this is from Felicia. This is from Mrs. Walker to Roland oh. Walker nice. on this day. Nice. Yeah. What do you Jesus say to Felicia? Christ. Thank you. You have written, I love you. I love you too. Thank you. Thank you so much. This is a surprise. <laughs> I think you arranged this. <laughs> I know it's you. This is like an Anglon boy that <laughs> <laughs> who is being shown love. He doesn't even know how to. Wow. <laughs> it's okay. Hey, hey, hey. Don't touch the thing. Okay. All right. Should we go back to the newspapers? Yeah, we should. <laughs> oh, let's go on. Let's go. Why? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> okay. No comments. All right. Uh, <laughs> so I was talking about, just before the surprise, <laughs> talking about the Ghana Health Service uh, briefing the press yesterday extensively and allowing people to ask questions and give an update on the coronavirus. Uh, so we know now, well, we've known uh, for, for some time now that because of expert advice, we're not bringing back the students uh, in Hubei, province in Wuhan uh, specifically we're not bringing them back home because we've been advised against it yesterday I interacted with some of the students at least one of the students in Wuhan uh, and the descriptions that they give I think you should be in their shoes to feel how how they are feeling uh, lots of people dying every day around them and you know they're, they're just in their hostels in their rooms and they can't go out they can't come in and it's traumatizing for some of them so I guess the conversation will continue. Uh, let's look at the center spread of the paper, though. No, the back page. Um, Okwafo Foundation develops app to support farmers. Steel bridge over uh, Ochi River completed. Two stories on the back page of the Guardian Times newspaper. Let's do the Weekend Crusade and Guide newspaper. Front page of the Weekend Crusade and Guide. Roland still, Roland still, you know, trying to, I don't know, he hasn't gotten over what has happened. Doesn't believe it. Oh, uh, let's go on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Let's go on. Let's so go let's on. do the Why, why are we? Why are the, we? <laughs> uh, I knew it. He's not even here. Can somebody get me Kojo so that we can pack Roland away? Uh, the new Weekend Crusading Guide, Echo, we will see apologizes to Kweku Bakum and Nas over Galamse. Four cities, okay, so a retraction and apology of that on the front page of the paper. They've published the letter of apology, actually. Uh, Brian Champon, Henry Corte reassigned. Dasibre Otibuateng Swiss in Ochimpim Hene. I hope I got that right. Ochimpim Hene. Ah, okay, it's not always Ochimpim Hene, yeah. You're yeah, right. Ochimpim Hene. Mm. Okay, contractor moves to unseat fisheries minister. Uh, that's on the NPP primaries. I guess their banner headline is this echo. We'll see apologizing to Kikubako and Anas. A bit of it. On the first day of March 2019, I caused to be published and made several statements on Adum TV, Adum Bedroom program hosted by Omar Hinokwam Asante against Mr. Abdul Malik Kikubako Jr which are defamatory. Mm. That's in discussing issues surrounding illegal mining. I uttered words to the effect that Mr. Uh, Abdul Malik Kwekubako Jr. and Anas, together with, uh, I think that uh, some other companies, were involved in Galamse activities destroying Ghana's forests. So he goes on to talk about the things that he said uh, that were defamatory, now he's retracting and apologizing. Uh, that apology on the front page of the New Crusading Guide newspaper today. Let's do the final front page of the finder. 1.4 million farmers, 1.3 million students, 
367,121 teachers. NIA data reveals top 10 occupations in Ghana. That's pretty wow. interesting. Wow. Very interesting. Yeah. On page two. So 8.5 million registered. Uh, oh, wait. Okay, hang on. Okay, this is on the on the gun. No, 1.4 million are farmers. 1.3 students. All from data from the national from the NIA. identification mm -hmm. authority. Wow. So, uh, 8.5 million Ghanaians have been registered for the Ghana card. This is as as at February 8, 2020. And according to the data, 1.4 farmers have so far registered. Uh, imagine as the highest occupation. So we have a lot more registering as farmers on the register as in the national ident identifying themselves as Ghanaian, Ghanaian farmers who have registered 1.4 million. In the second position are students with 1.3 million of them registering for the Ghana card. The third highest category of people that registered for the card are retail market traders mm. who numbered 791,760. Wow. Yep. And then uh, four 453,421 are unemployed, mm. and this places them at fourth position. They are fourth. Uh, the, so they come before the teachers. So the teachers are 367,121. Mm. Uh, the businessmen and women who have registered uh, so far amounted to 324,431. Uh, and then it goes on to talk about tailors, dressmakers, um, and related workers. Their total number is 267,943. You mean mm. designers? Well, that's what they've written. <laughs> and then ranking in the eighth position, uh, hairdressers, barbers, beauticians, related workers. That comes up to 204,507. And uh, the number of retirees who have so far registered for the Ghana card amounted to 179,155. This is good data, uh, good data. They've got bricklayers, carpenters, and other construction workers as well. That comes up to 119,829. Talked about how uh, we don't have data as a country. And this uh, looks like a very good uh, place mm, for mm. us to go. And it, it also comes back to, because we collect data on a lot of platforms, apart from the, uh, the national, national identification, identification. I think it should be the go-to place. Yes. Honestly. And, and we know this is also just uh, it looked like closely coming on the heels of the argument about um, registering people for new voters, etc. Yeah. And uh, it, it speaks volumes. Because I remember that day on News File, about a month or about three weeks ago, when this argument was made, the National Identification Authority boss, um, Professor Kenatifa, was called in. And he said, look, if the time was given up to about July, um, July August, mm -hmm. they could complete it in time. Yeah. And that even surpasses the Electoral Commission's own timelines of when it will be ready. It was just a matter of precedent and uh, a lack of trust, so to speak. Yeah. And this one even aggregates or disaggregates the, the data very well. Yeah. So you can it extrapolate. Does. It does. You can know who is. And, and I, yeah. I think I, I love this. But love once this. again, we're not consolidated. So we'll have people um, repeating what you know, the National yeah. Identification is yeah. already doing. A complete waste of money, I exactly. think. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, NPP, uh, no, Dr. Baumia leads NPP's 2020 Manifesto Committee. I lied that an ask we could back why into Galamse. That's a call we'll see begging there. Uh, and then mass evacuation of Ghanaians, not an option yet. Mm. Uh, this one is attributing it to the Ministry of Health. But yesterday the press conference was the Ministry, no, no, the Ghana Health Service. Yeah. It comes under the Ministry anyway. And uh, the Ghanaian Times newspaper front page president reassigns two ministers. Three political parties storm out of EC technical meeting. Three Chinese murder suspects arrested. 20,000, Roland, 20,000 mad persons on the loose. Roam streets nationwide. They're on the loose. Before which, ideal, think, which ideally should not be happening. They should be housed or accommodated in a mental health facility. Mm -hmm. hmm. Yeah, but 20,000, it means that some people that you thought... Oh, okay. Beyond those who are just walking on the streets. Mm. <laughs> Definitely. Mentally. Uh, but yeah. the, the people who look like it, those that you have seen, how <laughs> yeah, many sure. are, are you know, they? Just 
<laughs> just this week, I had some interaction. I thought people just with some mad people. <laughs> no, yeah, life. maybe <laughs> just didn't look right in the head. They just didn't feel right <laughs> because some of the all chances within the period. You said Charlie. <laughs> Okay, but this is serious. This is a serious matter of patience, yeah. um, essentially patience, people needing care, roaming about. Uh, the Daily Statesman, that's the last newspaper. Uh, for me, NPP puts top brains to task as Baumia leads crack manifesto team. NDC is sabotaging for a Dam project. Uh, Upper East NPP fingers Haruna Idriso. Uh, there's a story on the reassignment as well. And Jakura Ventures on it at Investing Africa Excellence Awards. Rona? Yeah, so Lawrence let me just papers. quickly go through the two that I have. Well, yeah, my two. I'll do two. Okay, so we have the Daily Guide has on the front page. Mahama Bags at EC Boss has an attached picture of the two. Electoral Commission Boss, Gene Mensah. And then also uh, John Mahama attached there. So we also do have uh, two ministers reshuffled. Uh, we know it's the, if not the most topical issue this morning. Mm, uh, Ziavi Chief's Lord Nana Development Efforts, no bail for coup plotters. On the back page is full of sports. Sunny Dara named, our own Sunny Dara named CAF Media Officer for tonight's Super uh, Cup game. And I, and I know that Zamalek is playing that game as well. And uh, it's between uh, the Confederation Cup winner Zamalek. And uh, is he Esperance? Oh, okay, yeah, Esperance of Tunis. Oh, all right. I, I hope I'm right. But I know Zamalek is playing. Uh, they are playing uh, this cup uh, at, uh, at Qatar in Doha, to be um, more specific. Okay, so we also do have uh, on the front page of the next paper, the Daily Dispatch newspaper. It's uh, a story about the Supreme Court ruling that secret recordings not admissible in court mm. as evidence. And we know this also comes on the back of many other related things. Anti-graft campaigners have always uh, tend to advocate that we should use uh, what we call in journalism uh, subterfuge means. But uh, in, in the world of intelligence, uh, they call it um, covert means to gather uh, uh, data. You record people, and, and Charlie, by this time, the court say, Charlie, this one will be 7-0, 7, -0, 7 -0. Oh, the, the justices on the, on, on the panel that day um, just ruled. Nobody opposed, so. Uh, we also do have on the front page of the Daily Dispatch newspaper, ex-president uh, Kofo advises, go to court and challenge issue of new voters register has an attack picture of um, the former president John Ejikonku for we brought you that story we know that uh, a, a Mohammed Atik led pressure group went to visit the former president <laughs> and focus on education in central Volta and Ashanti regions that's a good one okay so let's the uh, uh, time we, we have do my yeah, 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 yeah we should we should we should we should are you okay, I'm, Roland I'm Walker? I'm very okay. Yeah. But, I, but if you did do that oh, too. Did man. I say thank you to Felicia for this? Because yeah. this is mine. Yeah. Yeah. So, so you, you, you did the arrangement? I didn't do any arrangement. Okay. I mean, we're all on the show when yeah. the, the stuff yeah. came. It, it, this is... This is connivance. This is your beautiful, amazing wife. Oh, thank you very Surprising. much for the cake. That's much online. Dot com. You didn't tell me you... Yeah. That's, that's well, why it's a surprise. No comments. Okay. No comments. Okay. Okay. No comment. <laughs> I know you're not that romantic, so it's okay. Just smile. Uh, <laughs> I beg, let's go to my jaw line. Why? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> okay, that's it. GES interdicts Upper West Regional Director of Education. A number of allegations against him, including bribery, corruption, uh, and other stuff. EC calls on Otum Fosei to the second. That's a 10-member delegation from the EC, led by the chairperson, Peter Kersi, call on the Asantehine at the Mengshia Palace. 63-year-old woman burned to death uh, at uh, Juanti, which is a farming community in the Kwando municipality. Rather tragic there. Uh, details of that on myjawline.com. Meet Kumasi's big Shatawale fan 
Shaka boy, he's 21, uh, and he says, you have to catch up on the story. He says he uses his, like the very little that he has to get Shatawali souvenirs. That's like a fun. If you say you're a fan of someone, this is what you should be doing. Yeah. I'm not saying don't get, like in this, in this case, this is like crazy fun right there. But no, you've he, got to he, buy he, things yeah. off the person so that we know you're supporting. Hey, so he, go to their concert. Buy if it's mm, T-shirt, mm, whatever, whatever. Mm. That's that's the, what the, the only are. thing is, is that in Ghana the souvenirs are not copyrighted, so it's not for the people themselves. Patented, it's yeah, just, exactly. Yeah. Because ideally, in a in the more developed countries, or let's say Southern Africa and Northern Africa, there will be a third party uh, company that they will give, they will outsource that to. They will sign some agreement, so they get something from the sale of the merchandise. Yeah. Yeah, I agree with you. Mm. But perhaps is, I, I, they can look at how they can do that. Because uh, once people love you and they buy your yeah. stickers and all that. Except that I have an issue. Sometimes they have like a shop, they come up with something like a brand. And they don't sell But then, no, they, the price will be so high. Sometimes I wonder if they really know the people who follow them. Uh, and then they will go and yeah, put I think the shop so, in like airports or somewhere Sakwa like that. Somebody started something like that. The shop like was in Jowulu. Like, and you and go I there and uh, the well, it's not easy. Really the shoe alone, the right sack for Toba Chadi. No, no. All right, let's do the rest of the stories. Benedict uh, is standing by, getting ready to tell us what's going to happen uh, this weekend. We're looking out for Oli, PNC chairman Vent of Akufo, suggestion for opposers of new voters register not to use militancy. Uh, Eko Eusi apologizes to Bakum over Galamse claims. The story is actually everywhere uh, this morning, really. I kept wondering how come it got the mileage thing. Charlie, when you say things about someone and you don't have proof, <laughs> J, J, if they take you on. Uh, photo of the week, sisters behind the land. At the St. Mary Senior High School 70th anniversary celebration over the weekend, the Roman sisters also made a show in with their cameras to capture the sights and sound. Okay, so you can uh, catch up on it. I'm sure it'll be beautiful. I haven't seen it yet. It'll be good to open it up and check it out. Uh, and then government not banning importation of cement. Uh, Deputy Trade Minister seeking to clarify, uh, you know, some of the things that came out. Mm. All right, Parliament's Health Committee backs decision not to evacuate Ghanaians from China. Uh, Brian Champon's new appointment attempts to rig elections. That's uh, the interpretation put on this change by the General Secretary of the NDC. Johnson is here in Ketia. General Mosquito. Ekofuado reassigns Brian Champon's interior ministry, new national security policy in the often. Aha, this is the one that I couldn't hear properly, no? This is Mr. No, Kandapa uh, going to no, Parliament. I think so because no. you were having diverted uh, minds. Samum. You know when he appeared before the commission, uh, the uh, Emil Short Commission. He, his posture, you know, like even the projection, like when he spoke, was definitely different from when he appeared before Parliament <laughs> this week. I guess that's the confusion. And to, be tr and to be truthful, yesterday when I watched the news, I mean the video of it, yeah. uh, I was just watching how... His yeah. because he couldn't hold I beg, is it our fault? <laughs> no, it was uh, our it's fault. It's not our fault, <laughs> are we? Yeah. We're just All doing right, the we've got like plenty this. more stories on my jawline. <laughs> Am I being mischievous? No, yeah, I don't think no, so. I think all it's of us well are. chocolate day. It's chocolate day today, y'all. Yeah. It's the day of love. So, you know, I'm showing a lot of love. Will you miss me? Yeah. <laughs> you're, but, Benedict. But, but, but this, was, this was good. Benedict. Very romantic. Yeah. You're welcome. We have a yourself. treat. Yes, we do. Um, we do. You know, are, you going to right? hold, are you going to hold that uh, throughout the show? Are you going to hold that? <laughs> oh, we got the show? we got chocolate from Cocoa Processing Company, Company as well. We oh, okay. appreciate. So Benedict, after sports, you can yeah, come and I, I already have mine. Dig in. Year. I already have um, one. Joel, you can come and dig in. Uh, not now. Don't come here right now. <laughs> but I already have mine. So, mm. so we we thank the Cocoa Processing Company as well. And then, you know, if you're driving. Bye, you can also just stop by. We've got cake. We've got lots of beautiful Bobby. things here this morning. People should stop by. How many yeah, they should stop by. How many chocolates do you have on the table <laughs> that year? Oh. Do you know the number of people that will come here? Oh, okay. I think we have a couple. There's uh, plenty where that came oh, from. I know. A couple. But there's also cake. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. From okay. Romantic. From Roland's wife, <laughs> Felicia. 
Oh, and that's I, beautiful. I oh, Ronald, made... is that from your wife? Yes, please. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Lovely. Very awesome. Mama B, is that from your husband? She, she, this is from... She, this is from... She, she, call, she called the, her uh, cake production company uh, mm. Awesome Rola, Cakes. Don't, don't say anything. <laughs> I said awesome just cakes. smile. Just smile. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's uh -huh. beautiful. Very so nice. she made one for me lovely. as well. This oh. is mine. Oh, yeah. lovely. Yeah. Lovely. So Felsom Gala Limited, thank mm. you very much. So this is the conspiracy reward. <laughs> Benedict, what yeah. should we expect? All right, so we'll talk about uh, Legon City's and uh, Accra Great Olympics plus what we expect this weekend in the Ghana Premier and League. Roland, do you, you know how to play ping pong? Table tennis? Table tennis. Yeah. Not me, yeah, the Accra, but we do some time in Mija. We have I, a world class facility, apparently. Yeah, we do have a world class facility. Cool. Yeah. Uh, the, I'm okay the, with it. The table yeah. tennis uh, season opener is uh, on this weekend. Uh, at the Fantasy Dome, uh, and it's open to the public, so you don't have to be a professional table tennis. They have player. tables there, lots of uh, them? A lot of, 32 wow. boards there, wow. so yeah, so you can uh, get through, we'll, we'll do that as well, plus uh, other stories.